Okay, welcome back to some more Carbet Vanguard Zero. And no, your eyes are not lying to you. I did a bit of a naughty, and whilst editing the first part, I actually played a bit more and went through the tutorial. No big deal though, because you didn't miss much. It was literally just a, them teaching us how to do triggers. And I feel like we all know how to do triggers. So yeah, it was very repetitive and tedious. Now let's see what else the game actually has to offer for us. So, uh, let's see. Uh, let's receive that. Nice. Okay, so that's saying clear story ride force. So that might be the next thing that I want to do. Aichi, I'm going to be real with you, chief. Please shut up. <laughs> Uh, I also did a little bit of a naughty and I got some packs off screen, but to make it up to you, I just opened some more now. So yeah, uh, basically to make a long story short, what happened, basically to make a long story short, what happened was I had some issues with uh, some file formats and stuff with the recording, but it should be sorted now and it was kind of frustrating and it took a very long time. So that's, and so to deal with that, I, well, you know, brand new Vanguard game, kind of played a bit of it off screen, you know. So, let's uh, open some more packs. Uh, so again, there's not all that much I'm particularly hoping for, necessarily, because I don't particularly care for these clans over some of the other ones that I'm assuming they'll add support for later. So I'm just kind of opening packs. Uh, you do get achievements and items and stuff for collecting cards, so even if there's nothing particularly I want from these packs. Although I did get a few good stuff there actually, that was better than a few of my previous off-screen packs. I'll show you what I got from those uh, in a sec if I can. Uh, so yeah, whilst there's nothing particularly I, uh, I'm like uh, fasting for, I guess. Uh, it's still good to collect them anyway, basically. I mean, it's a gacha game, of course, you know? So that's the crafting stuff. Uh, I'm not 100% certain how that works at the moment, but I guess we'll see. So, yeah, here's um the cards I have. Feel free to... I don't know. I don't feel like I, don't feel like I have anything particularly special. I feel like I'm, I basically have the same kind of cards that pretty much everyone else that's starting off has. So, there's nothing too big there. And I guess our next big thing is to go to my profile. <laughs> I really been switched to there. Uh, let's check my profile options and stuff. Um, I guess let's go World Paladin. Uh, oh, okay, I can set my profile picture, I guess. Yeah, sure, that one's fine. Oh, and there's some I can unlock. Okay, yeah, sure. That's kind of neat. So, yeah, those are all the pro pictures you can want. Ah, okay, that's all right. Um, yeah, if you see my friend code or whatever, feel free. I don't particularly mind if you add me or not. Um, cool. Okay. No use putting off the inevitable, trying to get embarrassed <laughs> and do our first actual card fight. Use a deck with the latest cards and take on a challenge. Okay, so uh, it's actually recommending I go against Aichi first, and that's very, very interesting. So I definitely can't edit my deck yet, right? Yeah, I haven't unlocked that option. So I guess I'm just going to go against myself here, I guess, uh, and just hope that I win. So we'll do that. So yeah, this is going to be our first proper card fight. Everything before this point was just uh, fairly basic, simple tutorial stuff. So now we're actually getting into the game. And this is the part where I get really scared because I don't know if I can, well, last multiple hours without any sleep and also commentate over this game and also play well at the same time. So this is going to be fun. So do I want that? It's unit boosts. That's alright, I guess. Um, but I, yeah, I'm gonna go with that one first. Uh, okay. Uh, ooh. Yep, let's move that back. Cool. That's a nice thing to have. Activate skill, because why not? Uh, let's see. Ragard. Uh, remove a critical 
Sand and Banks, uh, Critical was removed, Cole began at home. Sure, why not? Let's do it. Uh, uh, yeah, I'll do that one. Nice. And now it's really fun. Hmm. I don't know where to put this actually. I guess I'll put that there. For now. We can always move it back later. And then, I guess. I guess we can put that down. Uh. Sure. That's probably not the best setup to have actually. But we're just kind of. We're experimenting. We're seeing where we go, you know? Failures are fine. We can do failures. I can do failures. Uh, as long as they're not too embarrassing. Uh, cool. Ah, uh, well. <laughs> yep, there we go. We're getting chance to ready. Cool. Good to know. Hey, let's go then. Okay, so we're going to want to put Blaster Blade down. Because, I mean, come on, let's be honest. We're gonna want to put Blaster Blade down. Oh look, that's the fancy animation that they're probably gonna copyright straight me over. <laughs> uh, and then I guess let's put that there. And we'll activate that. And... Sure, let's do that. And put that there. Hey, okay. That's actually... I'm pretty happy with that. Uh... So I'm going to want to do that first. And we're going to completely destroy him. Uh, I'm going to give that one extra 5,000 because that one's not doing so hot. And of course, but that's fine. You know what, we're going to go for that one first. Because I'm, I'm clever all of a sudden. Yeah, it's not going to do us all too great actually. Uh... Alright, you know, I'm fine, I need to turn there. That's fine, I don't mind. Okay, so now we're just waiting for him to do his turn. Uh, luckily, uh, well, I was going to say luckily he doesn't seem to be doing so great, but actually he just entirely flooded the field. So, you know what, that's probably not the best thing in the world. Uh, cool. Nice, taking damage. That's alright, we can, we can deal with that. Panicking is just going to lead to more failure, so that's alright. We can take those hits, and in fact, we can actually heal those hits back. Cool. Nice. That's actually not too bad. Uh, so, currently we're tied with him, which is actually not too bad. Um, so, let's see. This unit cannot be boosted. During your turn, this unit gets plus 2,000 for each of your rare guards. That's pretty fucking good, actually. And I can count a blast free. Well, I can't, can I? Because I don't have free. Uh, during your turn, if you have two or more grave free units, this unit gets... So I'm thinking, hmm, so this one's effects only work on the Vanguard, so I'm going to want to put that one on the Vanguard for obvious reasons. Yep, and then this one gets powered up when there's more than one grade free, so we're going to do that, and then we're going to do that, and he can't be boosted anyway, so we may as well use that effect, so, hmm, I guess, let's just put that there. Yeah, sure. Why not? You know what? That probably wasn't the smartest idea in the world. But you know what? Deal with it. <laughs> Just deal with it. Uh, we don't make mistakes. We make happy accidents. It's okay. So we're going to do that. And take that thing out. And then... Ooh, that's looking pretty fucking good if you ask me. Uh, you know, I'm just gonna go straight for the attack into Vanguard. There's no point in retiring that Ragard unit. He's, he's too weak to really stand much of a chance against me, I'd say. So, I'm just gonna do this and just hope that he doesn't pull anything. And in fact, I'm gonna pull something anyway. Haha! <laughs> Take it, you piece of shit! <laughs> My, like, confidence levels and my, like, com incredibly nervous levels 
they they interchange pretty quickly. You know, I'll give myself that. Um, I'm gonna give my Vanguard that power because you know, I, none of my other units can use that right now. So we're just gonna do that, and it's gonna work for us. So that's good. Um, now we're just gonna hope that he doesn't tear our asses apart. So let's let's do that. Uh, okay. Uh, that's the thing I do a lot. I accidentally click on a card and like view its effect and it just takes up the screen So I can't see what I'm doing and I don't even realize I'm doing that. So that's annoying uh, But this seems to be kind of blank self right here. Uh, I don't seem to be doing too awful actually at, uh, at holding up here I, I am taking damage don't get me wrong, but it's fine because it's my turn now So I can just tear his ass apart and I still have my two perfect guards So, you know, that's actually looking pretty good for me uh, during your turn, if you have more than one, more red guards in your opponent's unit. Oh, I'm putting that there. Come on. Um, yep. Activate skill. Ye. I want to do that one. Uh, push. uh, call it grade two or less. I, you know, I'm just going to go Blaster Blade because, you know, you can never really go wrong with Blaster Blade. Uh, and I'm gonna put him there. Yeah, put him there. Nice, and I can do that. And yep, cool. That was pretty successful, I'd say. Uh, now, we're gonna bow, and... Whew, okay, gotta think about this. So he doesn't have any... Yeah, he doesn't have any great... Twos. So that's good. That means there's nothing really just stopping me from. So I'm not gonna bother with his grade one. Oh. Yep. I'm not gonna bother with his grade one because his grade one seems too weak to really be worth it, in my opinion. So I'm just gonna go straight for his grade freeze instead because, again, I don't really think his grade one is powerful enough to really be bothering with at the moment. Um. You know what, we're going to bother with it anyway because we don't really have anything else to do with this other unit. Ideally, I should have attacked with that other unit earlier, but you know what, I think I can shake this one off. I think I'm fine. So, he's going to summon another grade 3. God damn it. I really didn't want that, actually. This could really win him the game, actually. Damn it. <laughs> so, luckily I had a grade 2, which means he had to attack that one first, so that's good for me. But now I'm going to take a damage from that. But I'm also going to get uh, a trigger there. So that's alright. And he doesn't get any triggers. So I'm actually safe. Yeah, I'm actually safe there. Okay, cool. So now I have one turn left to kind of win this one over. And I still got my perfect god. So you know what? I think I'm actually doing pretty well here. So what I'm going to do is... Uh, yeah, I'm just going to battle, actually. I'm just going to battle. Um, hmm. I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna tank and get that grade 2 out of the way with my grade 2. Uh, then, I'm gonna boost and take that out and then hope he just doesn't pull anything. Yep, and then, oh, yep, of course. And then I'm gonna do this and once again hope he just doesn't pull anything. But I'm gonna pull something, so you know what, I, that was really useful. I don't necessarily think I needed it, but it was useful nonetheless. And so as long as this attack goes through, I've basically won. So, yeah. Cool. That went really well, actually. I know that was the first card fight, and the first card fight is obviously an intentionally easy one to really just kind of get you through it. But that worked. That went well. I think I'm pretty happy with that. That was actually very fun. Uh, so that's a good sign. It's a good sign that if the beginning more simplistic card fights are fun, then it's gonna get even more fun as it progresses. Hopefully. That's that's the hope. So now we're gonna close and we're gonna see what it is we're actually doing. I will probably do the Kai card fight before I actually leave for today's episode, but before that point, I just wanna... Uh, yeah, let's just go straight to the Kai one then, because it doesn't really seem like there's anything else worth doing at the moment. We're just going to kind of power through this. So let's hope that I don't get embarrassed. Um, I haven't unlocked the Decadent yet, have I? I don't think so. Uh, I bet you I have, and I just didn't realize, and I get completely destroyed here. So let's see. Let's, uh, now that Kai isn't teaching us how to play anymore. Oh! 
Oh, I didn't realize that. Oh, I'm playing as Kai, not against him. Okay, that's gonna make things considerably more interesting, because I'm not very familiar with this deck, actually. Um, okay, let's do this. So, uh, uh, Vanguard. Oh, well, you fucking just put that there, then. <laughs> and it's gonna lag for a second. So, it turns out the Bush Road were right when they said the Singapore version is actually just a server test because the servers farted on themselves when I tried starting up the Kai card fight. So, I'm trying this again and hoping it works. Uh, yeah, that's the thing. There's a bit of a new give and take when it comes to this kind of thing because, you know, it is only a two week server stress test. So, obviously, there are going to be times where it kind of messes up. So, uh, I didn't get like, far at all in the card fight. In fact, this is how far I got, so... Uh, yes, we're going to start off by writing that. And... Uh, we're gonna put that behind. And we're gonna put that there, and we're gonna put that there. Uh, yeah, that seems about right. Uh, okay, so let's see what he's doing. Uh, so... Next episode, I'm thinking, is when we're going to really kind of delve into the story and stuff. I just wanted to get a, a couple of good card fights out of the way, you know? So, uh, I think that's a good way of doing it, you know? Uh, first episode, tutorial stuff. Second episode, some kind of more, like, out of context, I guess, card fights. And then third episode, we kind of delve into the story. Uh, it is a little bit of a shame that the story is just the same old story we've already seen before. It's the same old 2011 anime. Uh, that everyone's familiar with, but at the same time, um, I can't talk while I'm playing Carhartt Vanguard, basically. Uh, <laughs> oh boy. Um, yeah, sure. Let's do that one. Um, and then that means oh, that we can do that, that we can do that. Uh, push. let's go for. Uh, Yeah, I want that one in my hand. And... Yeah, let's do that. Okay, cool. And now we can battle. Actually, we should probably fight with the weakest one first. Which it feels weird saying that my weakest one is the Vanguard, but I'll give my critical to that one. So I can get a second attack it. Yep. Oh, nope. Damn it, wasting that critical. Oh well, I can still... No, I can't. What did I do that? <laughs> oh god, what am I doing? Oh, oh boy, yep. That was, a good, that was very classy of me, getting 8 and 6. Again, I feel the need to stress, and in the next part I won't have this excuse anymore. Because I'm forcing myself to sleep after I finish recording this part. But, but I have not slept in a very long time. This game released like 5am. So um, I'm doing good all things considered. <laughs> yeah, I deserve to lose here, don't I? Okay, so uh, we're still going to actually uh, manage to kind of uh, survive that one anyway. Um, and I mean, we're going to... Uh, so we kind of blast free to get, yeah, okay. You know, I'm actually going to put that one out there instead of Dragonic Overlord, actually. Uh, and then I'm going to put out Dragonic Overlord there. And then I'm going to, uh, see, do I want to replace, ooh, do I want the security of the grade two at the front or do I want to just go for it. Uh, I feel like right now, I kind of just want to be going for it, you know? Wait. <sighs> Fucking duh. You know what? Yeah, we're gonna... We're gonna do that. <laughs> my, my brain farts sometimes. Uh, and we're not gonna use the green ones because those are perfect guards, and those are kind of too important to not use at the moment. So... 
We're once again going to use our weakest card, which is the Vanguard, and we're going to do that, and that's going to be fantastic. And we're going to give that to that. And we are going to retire one of their rare cards. So we're just going to retire... Ooh, boy, I'm going to retire this one, actually. Because I feel like having the one at the front is actually more reliability than anything else. So, now we're going to give our extra power... Oh, uh, you know what? You know, I'm just going to keep pumping it into Overlord. And I'm going to retire... That grade zero. And we're going to get rid of that grade two. And... Now we can really start to put the hurt on him. So we're going to do this, and we're going to hope that he doesn't get anything in his pool. He's going to get something anyway, but that's fine. We can we can still tackle that because we've got a thousand more attack than him anyway. So it's cool. And he's going to get something anyway. So fucking... <laughs> Why do I even bother sometimes? Basically. Oh, uh, God, that misplay from earlier is going to cost me the entire game, isn't it? Yes, we get it. You have an Alfred. Very cool. And he's just going to flood his field. Cool. No, this is good. Oh boy, I was not lying when I said that I was fucking tired. <laughs> this isn't me like being bored or anything. Uh, yep, okay, cool. You got nothing. That's good. And I got something. So, ha <laughs> Skill may not be on my side, but luck is. <laughs> uh, you know what? Do I want to ride? I don't want to ride. I want to put that there. I'm going to activate Overlord skill. Okay, so, hmm, I've got an idea, but it's a very risky one, but I feel like at this point a risky idea is the only idea we've really got. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this, and I'm going to hope that I get something good, and I will. And I'm going to play it a little safe. Ah, oh. Yeah, I'm going to play it a little safe, and I'm going to give him the critical. And I'm going to retire... I'm going to retire that one. And... Yep. Okay, nothing. Yep. Oh, damn. That's not great for me, actually. There's nothing I can really do about that. Um, well, I mean, he does still have the rare guard, so I can still take those out, I guess. So, I'm going to take that one out. And I'll take that one out. And I'm just gonna... He doesn't really have that much of a hand. He's only got two cards right now. So hopefully... Those two cards aren't very good. But something's telling me they might be perfect cards. <laughs> just a little inkling of a feeling. Yep. Okay, so they're not perfect cards. So that's good. As long as I can survive this turn, I should be fine, actually. Uh, will I be able to survive this turn? That's the question we're all asking right now. So I'm gonna use that guard. And somebody's telling me I'm going to have to use my other guard in a sec, too. Yep. Oh, boy. If there was ever a card fight, I did not deserve to win. Uh, I'm just going to... Should I waste my perfect guard? I feel like if I... I feel like if I can't make it to my next turn... Then the perfect guard's going to be wasted anyway, because he's definitely going to attack more than once. And I can only really take one attack, so I think I'm just going to put it down anyway. And I'm going to battle. Oh, frick, I forgot he had a grade 2. So I'm going to take his grade 2 down with this. And now we can kind of just hope. That he just can't... He doesn't have a hand, so that's a good sign. Trigger? Oh, yes! 
I did not deserve that win, but I got it anyway. So yeah, that was fun. That was good, actually. So, um, once this is loaded and connected, there we go. Thought it might have crashed again. That's a good sign. So yeah, next time I guess I'll see you back here uh, with the story mode. Because that's a thing I can do. I've got 129 stamina. That's quite a lot, actually. I guess they give you a lot out of the gate to make sure you actually use it. Uh, so yeah, we'll see you there with a the story. Uh, see you later.